Hey guys, and welcome back to Dominion's 5 with me, Time and Tactics. It's the fall in year 3 of the Ascension Wars. What, uh, what did we do last time? Let's go ahead and jump into the game. So, we are being attacked by Ulm here, but we are pushing back now. Mm, might be a little bit late, but we'll see how it goes. There's 60 enemy units here. We're not going to take care of them. We're going to go down to the Whispering Waste and take care of them instead. Right now, we are... I guess I'm sending Angusa down to Felden Forest. Why did I send him down there? I don't think I want to go down there, right? No, we don't need to have him go down there. Instead, we should send him up to the Whispering Waste, shouldn't we? I don't see... Uh, I think maybe I did select him to go there and then and uh, I gave him a secondary order the following turn to go down there because nobody's going to make it down here, I don't think. Yeah, I think that's going to be fine. Uh, no, wait. Oh, yeah, I forget. Uh, I forgot what I was uh, doing here. We got these the Atlantean trips. 60 enemy units. Yeah, we do go down there. Let's do that. Yeah, I think that's fine. Yeah. At home, we have a Kaja defending. He's not going to defend. At a minimum, we're going to research. Adia, Adidaita. He cannot take these units because they are um, they are magical. So that's a bad thing. We only have five of the Tiger Riders as well. We'll keep them here for a little bit longer. Uh, I think that would be best. What do we have? Nine fire gems, making five per month. He's researching. Do we need anything else? We've used all the items. I think researching is the best. We're going to go to alteration five in about three turns. Alteration five gives us what? Transmute fire. I think here, yeah, transmute fire. Gold gain, 20 per gem spent. So if we do fire gems, well, I guess in, uh, it must be fire gems. Make turn them into gold. That is tempting, right? I don't not going to use him for any non-ritual. I don't think we're not going to be in, in battle with him. But the other spells here. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps scrolling up and down here. But anyway, uh, the other spells: Iron Warriors, Natural Protection twenty, which be good for one square. One square would get that. Yeah, it would be tempting to have somebody, but we can't really use this one. We would have to be uh, have to be a wishy to do it, right? Yeah, we don't have very much of that anyway. Baleful Star is a level three astral, which we do have seven pearls for that. Baleful Star, range seven provinces. The caster invokes a great maleficent and forces the evil star to take conjunctive position in the heavens above one province causing unfortunate events and evil deeds to occur. Anyone exposed to the evil star is getting cursed for the rest of his life. We could do that. Like, put it, uh, take a wishy and put it over Agartha's home. It's possible we could do that. Mother Oak, uh, level 5 nature, we don't have that. I mean, really, Alteration 5, Transmute Fire is the good one. We're gonna go for that one for sure. Yeah, that's pretty much all I can do. Level 3 here, though, in water, fire resistance for 15 squads. That's something we can do with the Yakshinis, both of them, actually. So, we'll go for that for now. Research there. Patrolling here. I think we have to patrol 100 units. And I want to take advantage of the fact that we have the province defense here as well. And if they attack in here, the Shamblers, yeah. And up here in Melmont, we are preaching for both of them. Right now, there are three hostile dominion here. And I want to hold it. I want to hold this one. I was debating, should I go and try to take a temple or two here, you know? We could go for old giant woods, uh, Tyrannia. We have the Throne of Law, right? Yeah, it's been claimed. So we, uh, we don't want to lose it. We want to be able to take... We want to hold this one first and foremost. Taking a temple doesn't seem as important. Down here, that reminds me, we don't have the Throne of Death. So we're not getting the five death gems. If I move up... Wait a minute. He's going to come down here, maybe. 
He's gonna come down here with this uh, army here, right? My problem is, well, <clears throat> if he comes down to list those lands, I can't send a Kaja up there to claim the throne. That'd be suicide, right? If I take, uh, if I take Angusa and the uh, Gondavas, move them up here, that's fine. But then in Dural Woods, they might take Feldon Forest. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think that's. He might go with Feldon Forest. We have some barbarians there. 18 gold left. Could do one more. Yeah, I believe it. Yeah, I'll probably go for that. So next turn, maybe we'll move up there. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Let's go for the next turn. I, I think um, I gotta turn things around now. It's gonna be bad. There was a battle in Uliathum. They attacked me there. What do they have? They have enough units. Hmm, I did get a few barbarians, but it's not gonna help. This cab here, Black Knight, and then on top of that, Cave Drakes, which are not, I mean, they're not bad. 22 protection, very slow, a lot of hit points. And then down here, they have their high protection units, 19 protection, infantry of all. Um, so they're gonna, they're definitely gonna beat me here if we speed it up a little bit. They come down here. Our commander's in the back. They could stop there. We might take out one or two of these. Yeah, we probably will. Are we taking out a cab? No, it doesn't look like it. That was Uliathum. Uh, we took out one light infantry. Okay. That's Uliathum. That's further to the north. If, if we're going to lose something, that's okay. The Whispering Wastes. We had a battle now. That's in... That's us coming down from the north. And taking them out. Yeah, we will definitely do that. We have our yogis back here. Is it yogis? Brahmins and gurus. Yep, and one yogi. Okay. So we cast we cast blessing. It's gonna be fine. I mean this is not anything. We have a mage here, level one, fire level two earth. I just hope he's not part of province defense. I don't think he is. We're waiting, but casting blessing. I think we got a few of the blesses in, right? Didn't we? Or did we not? No. Oh wait, I'm looking at. I was looking for the ethereal symbol. Blessed. They are blessed. Good. We're gonna do short work here of these units. There. He probably survived. We lost two of the Atavi archers. Yep. And he lost. No, didn't lose his priest smith. And then in White Spring Grove, they attacked. Oh, I'm here. Wait, that's where I went with. I had units here. White Spring Grove. He attacked me here. No, I attacked. I. Oh, he attacked me before I moved? I thought I was attacking. This is not looking good. It's not looking good here. Although we do have these. There's a lot of yogis here. And we have them. We'll see if they can catch up now. We're waiting here. There's Blessing and Mind Burn and Body Ethereal and everything. They're blessed at least. That's gonna help. And I bet you anything they gave themselves. Yeah, Body Ethereal. Why not, right? They are firing on these, but they have a lot of uh, protections. It's going to take a lot for them to take a hit. Now let's see if the Yeti comes up here. I want to throw the rock. Come on, Yeti. There, now we're going to start moving. That's Body Ethereal again, right? So let's see. Blessed and Body Ethereal. It's going to be hard to take him out now. There's a couple over here that just don't have Body Ethereal. Come on, Yetis. Do they get Body Ethereal as well? I should cast it on them, actually. Because they don't have anything in protection, really. We're moving forward now. The Yetis are quickly coming up. Can the Yetis be up there to throw boulders? Let's see. Okay, we're casting spells. Mind Burn, look at that. Axata cast Mind Burn. If we go check out... Let's see if I can get Axata here. Actually, we can sort by name, can we? 
No, it's not that. Mm. Laxata is down here. No. There, a guru. What did you end up doing? Mind burn, right. Hit an ogre, 19 points of damage. It's gone, it's dead. See all the damage to do? Yeah, that's quite good. If they can stay alive. What is the going on here? Mm, there's some effect going on there. I don't know what that is. He is also has a body ethereal. The only one that does not is this one. That yeti. Throw the rock. Throw the rock now. I think they might have. No. Yeah. No, that's Arthur Hitch Yeti. Okay, great. Um, so we didn't do that, but we killed him anyway. Let's see now. Did they get anything by any chance? No, nothing. I haven't cast any spell on them. But our units here should be decent. Blessed, you can see the, the stats here. Good. And then Ethereal as well. And three attacks. I don't know if this is going to be enough, though. I bet you anything here we are up at max fatigue. This one is a Brahmin. No, not fatigue, but uh, it's okay. They can still do their spells. So the Yetis ran forward anyway. Oh, I see what's happening here. These are size 2. The Yeti is size 4. They can squeeze in. We should have somebody size 3. And then we wouldn't be able to fit a Yeti in there, right? So now we're going to hope that we can hold the line here with these, which I'm not sure about. And then this. This we should be able to defeat them here. We can win, but we'll be. These yogis are all in bad shape. That's a Brahmin again. Yep. Yeah, they're over a hundred each. Take them a little while, then they cast another spell. Oh, they're gonna make that. We have a few units here. Everybody here is ethereal, so we're gonna do damage. The problem is, I guess, is we may have 15, 14 damage. Strength six. Uh, wait, he's weakened. Can't count him. Lost an arm. Can't count him. This one. 18. That's all we have. I don't know. It's gonna take us a long time to get through. Because all the all their armor. We're casting spells in the back, it looks like though. I think we are yeah, we're casting spells there. I hope they can flee if they I don't know. I don't know. Are they gonna make it? Who this is a chieftain. He's he's leaving now. And we don't have very many units left here. I don't think we're gonna make it. We're gonna lose these units. If I'm lucky, these can flee, which I don't. Yep, this yoga is gonna flee. This one is not, but he's unconscious. Okay. We have a lot of mages, so that helps, but I need even more mages to take them out. If you look at these, I bet you anything they have a lot of hit points lost, yeah. But not enough. We keep spreading out our attack, I think. Although, wait, wait, they are now retreating, some of them. Some are retreating, not all of them. We are retreating as well, but wait a minute. Who is retreating the most? We are. Yeah, they're coming forward. We're routed. Well, we probably made it with all the... No, did we? Yeah, we may have made it. 103. There, come on, go. Yep, yeah, you're gonna make it. Oh boy. Lost that battle. That's me attacking too. Oh wait, that was the other one. That was just, no, it was me attacking. It was them attacking. In White Spring Grove. Uh, let's see. They lost two Lord Guardians. Pretty expensive. Master Smith, one, survived. Archers, Infantries of Ulm. They lost most of their... No, they didn't lose most of the units, but they lost uh, the good ones, I think, here. The Infantries of Ulm. They lost... They, they kept one Cave Drake. They have a variety of things. It's the Black Knights, Black Plate Infantry, who are able to hold their line. Look at that. 14 of them survived. Hmm. And we lost 24 out of 47. One Bane. Oh, not a tooth died. One Guru. 
But then the yogis survived. That's a lot of yogis, seven yogis. Hopefully they were able to retreat. Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah. At least we did, we were able to retreat. White Spring Grove, okay. A new famous hero. Bahos Ruta, okay. Let's see. Let's see, White Spring Grove, they now took it from here. They went from here to there. It's not looking good. Here's where I am now, in Felton Forest. I was gonna go down to Dural Woods. There's nobody there. They probably have defense though. Promise defense. Do we take do we take Angusa? I mean he has a lot of units here. Body of Theo. They're gonna be really strong here, I think. Although, wait a minute, we have some of them there. That's not good. Body of, are they meant to be here? No, they retreated. These are the ones that retreated. We only gonna have Is it Devi Prasad? Devi Prasad maybe was there. Blessing three times. No, he's here. That's not the one. There. Angirasa and Ambava. Body Ethereal on all these units. That's all we we're going to do. So if I take Ambava, yeah, these three, you can see them there. Do we go down to Dwarf Woods? No, I think I go here instead. And then in Bandar Log. Um. Is this good? What if we attack like this? What if we do that? I don't know. That's not... Fire on close to enemy. Something like that, but that's not going to be enough to take the whole province, is it? Let me look at them here. The damage is okay, but not great. Hmm. And the skills, if they don't get the boost with a mage, which they might. Devi Prasad. What if we send them over to Dural Woods? And we'll take him as well. Maybe that can work. What does that do? We put him in the same spot. I think we'll do that. Body? Yeah, let's do this. Let's see if we can make it here. We'll put him here. So instead of doing that, hold an attack. That's good. So six of them there. That's going to be pretty good, I think. Because they're size three. If two fit in a square. We're going to be able to get body of thrill to all of them. And then we have a blessing. The blessing is also good. But where's that blessing going to go? Hopefully on them. Yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll attack here with those. That We should be able to take that. And then um, Angusa and his cohort move up here. It's not as bad as I think now, actually, because we are holding Whispering Wastes, right? With these units. That's okay. And then in Listless Lands, we have retreated with a few units. Right? That's what we did. If I move them up here... Yeah, I think I'll do that. We'll take all of them. Move them up here, and what do we get total then? They're holding and attacking, and they are holding and attacking in the center. I think I'll put them up there as well. Line formation. And we can take all of these and move them up here as well. Just using the cursor keys to fine tune them there. That's a lot of units here. And I'm putting them like this because I think they all have orders to cast pretty decent spells. There. Oh, one more. Well, that's a lot of them. Okay. If we do that, what are they actually doing? Blessing. It's a lot of blessings here. Blessing with two of them. Three of them. Do we need that? No, we don't. We don't need that. He's doing divine blessing. So forget about that. These made these priests, can we get them somewhere else? Yes, we can. We can take the priests here. 
those two and move them in here at the Rice Spring Grove and help out. If we do that, we're gonna have, we're gonna definitely have, it's better here for sure. We can get blessing on all of them here. Let's do that. Actually, we'll check that out now. So if they're gonna do blessing, are they in a good spot? No, they're not in a good spot here. There. Okay, going back here then. What do we have here then? So we have one that does Divine Blessing. And then we have one more. We don't need that. But you can cast spells, right? There are some spells you can do. You can do Ashes to Ashes if we run into Undead, which I don't think we will. Actually, we won't. We won't run into that. So maybe we'll do Blessing anyway. Yeah, we'll do that. So we'll take, actually, do we need to keep him anyway, just in case? We have, we have one here. We have two here. They're defending right now, it's a lot of them here actually. A lot of Brahmin. We have level three Dominion here, so that's not anything we have to worry about. So they're doing, what are they doing then? He's doing spells. He's not gonna do much. And then Blessing here. I'll, I'll take Akravasa and move him over to here as... Oh, wait. You move him over here. Yeah, we'll do that. Over in uh, White Spring Grove. There should be one guy. That's you. Akra, uh, Akravasa, right? There. And I think I moved him accidentally. There we go. Okay, that's going to give us a lot of blessing there, I think. And then here, we'll still have one holy. And then body ethereal across the board. Do we need that many body ethereals? Uh, we might. There's a lot of units here. There's a lot of units. Plus, and they might do it to themselves, so... We'll leave it at that. Yeah, let's do that. That is going to work, I think. So this one is going to be defensive. We have no... Oh, we have 14 defense now. 14 in treasury. There's not much here. That's because we're recruiting units here. Getting more of them. Yeah. And more units here. I'm going to take them off, actually. I think I can do that temporarily. Yeah. And you keep on patrolling. I think that's, that's a very good here. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Like that. Yep. So they're going to be fine patrolling, I think. We're still working on our research alteration five, so we can transmute uh, fire gems into money. That's two turns away. And we're saving up. Yeah, we're saving up to do that. We have 17 here, 23. I could get a Yaksha, another one. Magic items, nothing. We have the possibility to get uh, magic items because we have a. Uh, that we have the right level conjuration. Is it four or is it six? I think it's four. I mean construction. Construction four. Okay, so we can definitely get stuff. Okay, so we're researching. I think we should research. I don't want to use nature right now. Let's wait till next term. Then then we'll see what we'll do with the... Uh, we could get some Gandavas as well for him. Yeah, it's possible. But we're moving down with moving up with Angusa here to take them on together with a bunch of different uh, supporting units. I think that's going to be fine. At the same time we take the World Woods away. Hopefully. From Atlantis. And then we'll sit here against that army. Is that going to fly? Yeah. I think it will. I think it will. I think it's going to work. Now nothing is, is happening here. There's 110 units. It's fall and it's still open here because I think we are slowly removing the anime dominion by, by preaching here. It's a little bit of a waste though. Look at that, Agartha is in trouble, it looks like to me. Yeah, they're gonna attack down here soon. I'll wait there, I think. We have decent defense and we have one cab unit there. Okay, that's fine. They could be attacking there. They're up in Lyotham. Should I get more? Can this army 
<clears throat> defend against that. I don't think so. They could very well take it. We'll lose that in that case. But I can't defend it. Can I defend it? <clears throat> what do I have here? 24. Yeah, the two of them together can defend this. I can't afford to leave it. I don't think I can. Wait a minute. We have two units here that fled. Um, let's move in here as well. Let's double check. Okay, they're here. We're going to move them up there as well. Okay, good. We're going to take White Spring Grove. Then move up north. If they take Fukan, it's not good. But I don't think I want to expand anybody to go down there. Do we send up? Actually, let's send up Ikaja now to uh, Lissa's lands. Let's do that. And then he can, uh, well, what can he do? He can claim that throne. We should do it. That means I may not get that in three turns. In two turns. It's going to be three turns, maybe. Okay. Well, we'll see how that goes. I think that's what I want to do. Hold back a little bit of cash. Get more units. Yep. I think it will work. Wait. Ooh, one more there. Actually, a couple. Okay, we'll leave them there. Feldon Forest. Yeah, they were fleeing down there, I guess, right? Up to Feldon Forest. Did they? Did they flee there? Yeah, from White Spring Grove. Okay, so they're gonna... <clears throat> Um, everybody's moving up here, and it's going to be fine, right? Yep, there's nobody lingering. I don't see any dots there. Okay. Here. Cav back there. Move him there. And then here, let's just double check. There is a lingering. There, we have a couple of them. I didn't actually assign them. Okay, there. I think that will do it. Let's go for the one more turn here, guys. There's a lot of battles here. There was a battle in Whispering Wastes. Let's see. Now, who's attacking? Regular units, as usual. And then we have an army that is good. There's a lot of units here. We have a lot of yogis. That's him. Brahmin. Two gurus. Yeah, yeah, we have units here. Let's see. Blessing. We're going to get this, right? We're going to get the bless. Is this where we have our... Uh, our prophet is here. Yep, our prophet is here. What did I cast? Did it cast blessing? No, it's body ethereal. Okay, good. That's a lot of them there. They're rushing forward. Give us another spell. Okay, the, the province defense is coming up. That's fine. That's gonna take the the edge off, so to speak, with the with the cab. We can see we got a couple here flashing that had body ethereal. They're casting it back here, unfortunately. That cab. The cab did rush forward. It's good for us. Now let's see. A couple of them at a time. Come on, let's attack here. Oh wait. Okay, it looks like they mainly missed maybe one or two there. Are we casting mag uh, Mind Burn? Are we doing Mind Burn? Oh, I don't like it already. Uh, what do we have? The Yogi. Body Ethereal four times. And another Body Ethereal. Hmm, that's an awful lot of Body Ethereals. That's what we see, by the way, here when I'm flashing. I think you can see it there. Ethereal and blessed. They're going to be blessed, I think, yeah. And then ethereal. It's going to help a lot. It's going to help a lot. And I think all of these are ethereal. I think the five blue dots there underneath is ethereal. So we can see at a glance who is ethereal. This one is ethereal as well. Okay. Maybe the dots are not that, but anyway. Let's see, we are unfortunately on fire here. We don't have that many hit points. Hmm. Three calf here, holding up the entire army. If we can get make him flee, it would be very, very nice. 
Because they don't have very much left here. Did we do... Yeah, there's... So now they're fleeing. Did we actually do Mind Burn? I had two Gurus, I thought, here. Then... Okay, they did Body of Thrill and Mind Burn. Black Lord. 20 points of damage. And then 13. That's good. That is very good. But it's an awful lot of Body of Thrills. I don't think I need to do that many, right? Okay, some of them have left. Not everybody, but now we can focus fire here a little bit. I don't like... What are they casting there? They're casting some spell. Who is this? Who is the guy in the back? Here. This one. Fire Mage, level 1. Yeah, he's been doing... Magma Bolts. Look at the damage. Look at the damage. Damage roll 27. Protection roll 4. How does that work? Does it? You don't have... You can't defend. It's a ranged attack. <clears throat> that is very good. Magma Bolt. If you got a Fire Mage, which I don't. We can still win this. I think we will, because we can surround him now. Yeah, but we're not going to take him out. He left already. Yeah. We did win, but that was expensive. Lost 29. No, they lost 29. We lost... Tiger Riders only, nine of them, but that's... Well, it's not that bad, I guess, but... That Master Smith with his Magma Bolt, to killed two of them. A Guru killed one. Alright. Then we attacked in Dural Woods against Atlantis. Let's look at this one. We don't have very much, but we have a couple of yogis. I'm hoping they don't have too much of an army here. They don't. They don't. Good. There is one priest. There. Blessing. Ah. These guys? Yeah. Not the best to cast on them, right? You need to have them further away. We should have put them further back. But they are blessed, at least. Did we get another chance? Maybe. Yeah. Body of Thiel coming up. I don't see him. I don't see anybody. Maybe it's because they don't have any armor or protection, so they need something, you know, but really? Yeah. They're good archers, though. They do quite a bit. See their eight damage? See the floating eight? Yeah, we're going to take them out, including this guy here. I don't... That's probably the province defense, right? There. That was in Dual Woods. Yeah. That's all it was. We lost three Tiger Riders, though. Okay. But we took it. And a battle in White Spring Grove. We attacked there as well. White Spring Grove. This is what I want to see. This is the Gandavas that we have. That are super good. Surrounded by a lot of yogis. Casting body of cereal again. Uh, and maybe a Brahmin or two. I think that's what we have. Okay. So... They have a lot of units, but my money is on the Gandava. The Gandavas that we have. Plus, we also have in the front Angusa. He's decent. No shield, but look at the damage he can do. Strength is 25, basic 17, magic 8. He has this one, strength 3. And then he has this one, strength 5. The boots and the girdle of might. The thing is, can he die? He can die. We'll see if he gets a spell cast on him. Blessing and Body of Thiel. I want to see something on him here. He's doing his own thing, right? And Gusa, summon Earth Power. He's going to be one level stronger. He has, what? Twist Fate from the Rabbit Foot Charm. Okay. Nothing else here. Reinvigoration 7. I mean, it's, it's good. He is quite good. They are bodyguards, by the way. They're going to stay here. Okay, we got more. Now we have even more. This is ethereal and blessed. So, 17 attack and defense. And with ethereal, that's good. these are going to be super hard to take out, I think. 16 in magic resistance. Yeah, the Gandavas. If I could start over, then I would go for the Gandavas. I think they're really worthwhile. Um, what is, he has this uh, very nice... Lion Pelt, right. 
Uh, now he has what? Nothing. He's a priest sacred. He's not yet blessed. What has he done? Legions of Steel. Legions of Steel. That's plus three in armor, right? I don't see it here. It should have been... It gives you plus three in all armor parts, but okay. Show up here? No, it doesn't show there. <clears throat> okay, they're rushing forward. More blessing, more, more body ethereal. So they should at least have one of the two. Blessed, yep. At least blessed there. Uh, wait a minute, what is, where did he's he at? Well, let's see, when the smoke clears. Where is he at? He's still doing spells, I think. Yeah, he's over here. So he's now... Nope, still nothing. Yeah, he is blessed at least. So 17 instead of 13. And 15 instead of 11. Much better. And uh, Frostbrand is now up to 33. And what did he get? Oh, strength. Magic bonus 8, enchantment 4. <clears throat> he cast, what did he cast? Strength of Giants. And now, now he's going to do Iron Skin. He's going to go up to... He has uh, Natural Protection 5. He's going to go to 20. Okay, here they come. Good luck. What are these? Lion Trap Warriors? No chance. And let's see, did he get it? Iron Skin. 30 protection. There, 20. And armor is 19. For a total of 30. Uh, can't touch, ask for much more. Ethereal and blessed. He can take care of the entire battlefield, I would think. Unless, yeah, fatigue. He's not going to run out of fatigue either. Give him that vine shield and uh, it's all good. This army can do a lot. Yeah, the armor we have here. Yeah, look at that. They're going through them pretty quick. Wait. Fire resistance. We don't have that. They also have awe, which is really good. Okay, we're coming forward with him. He has his bodyguard. I think the bodyguard is also blessed, but not ethereal. So they still have good stats. We can give him Gandavas as bodyguards instead. Okay, one here is unfortunate to have a profuse bleeding. Okay. But he's rushing forward, right? Where's he at? There, he's right here. <clears throat> Not moving. Is he out of fatigue? Nope. He cast a lot of spells, but still there. Still no problem. Yeah, they have a lot of ranged units, though, so eventually, I guess, we're going to take damage here. We can look, actually, and see if we sort by owner. One Gondava is dead. One has taken damage. Two has taken damage. That's it. No, wait, we have a few here too, but not very many. Not very many. And Angusa has 28 hit points. That's his normal, I think. He hit Black Plate Pikeneer in the head with Frostbrand for 31 points of damage. Gone. They hit him, but they don't do any damage. Eventually they will, because the way you roll the die, you know, and you re-roll it. But he's fast too, isn't he? Huh? 13. He's gonna kill them now. On the, by himself, pretty much. He can't get through, though. Yeah, he can't get through. We're gonna plow right through him, I think, here. Let's look after a minute here to see where he is. Where he went. Uh, he didn't do that much damage. The Gondobas are doing all the damage, and they're doing massive damage. So if you look at that... Oh, I meant to... Uh, wait a minute. Uh, that was... Here... Let's look at the battle again. It's this one, right? Yeah, this one. Let's me fast forward. Yeah, you put him in the corner back there with all the spells. I think it's good. Let's go to the end here and take a look at him. That's all these tanky units there with the armor, right? But no luck against the gondolas. And we'll see how many he will have killed. I want to see what he actually did. And Goosa here. There he is. Wrong one. There. Anything white is what he did. 31 damage, you saw that. 12 points of damage. 
with a ranged attack. Cold damage, that is air of effect, isn't it? And then small cold air again, eight points of damage, or two with a minimum square. He attacked with a kick, was repelled, and then his helmet in the leg. I want to see him do that. Target was killed. No damage to him. 24 points of damage here for him as well. Against somebody, and zero there, 13. 25, 43, Frostbrand. Massive, massive damage. Let's see. We conquered it. We lost, uh, we lost two Brahmins. What happened back there? And one Yogi. The Archers. They kept on firing. We don't have anything on them, right? So two of our four Brahmins died. Three Gandavas. They took out 79. I think that's good. 10%, a little bit less than that. Two Tiger Riders, the Bodyguards, but... Yaksha took out, no, Yaksha took out six. Master Smith died, that's good, I like to see that. The Black Aculite, nothing special. Okay, and they lost most of their units here. All the good ones, right? Yeah, pretty much. Exit out of that. The Holy Buddha Jaya has died. We incarnated as Buddha Jaya. Oh, so here is one with reincarnation. So Buddha Raja has died. We are as Buddha Raja the Brahmin. He's given a second chance, so we got him back as the same, uh, same holy, same priest, I think. There was a battle in Fukan. Oh, they did attack there. A guard attacked there from the mountains. But I have a good army. I mean, compared to this, I think we can make it. <clears throat> the calf. We have quite a bit of calf here. This cab, what do we have? Two, four, six, eight. And some heavy infantry. Uh, yeah, we should do some damage on these units, I would think. Yeah, we took out quite a few of them. Now, let's see how it goes. We'll get our archers back here. They're gonna keep firing, I think. Oh, those are my cartas. Oh, yeah, they still have sticks and stones. Okay, keep doing that. And then we have heavy cab, heavy infantry coming up. We're gonna win. Yes, he didn't bring in enough units. It pays off in a good province where they have good province defense. Pump in a lot because the heavy cab, that's one of the best. These are not bad either, I think. These are good. 16 protection, 12 defense, not bad. That's Agartha. Good, we took him out in Fukan. We lost province, we only lost what? Two Atavi archers and four Marcatos, but they're, you know, they're coming back. And then a sneaky enemy was discovered. Uh, okay, that's at uh, Atlantis. What do they have here? A scout. Yeah, yeah, they're not gonna be able to make that. Nope. He killed somebody, I think. Yeah. But it's probably province defense there. Yeah, kill one Makata. That's fine. And then a sneaky enemy was discovered. And that would be... Who is this now? Oceania is coming ashore as well. That's... I mean, I think I did good this round, but... Boy, is that going to be enough? There, we took him out, but we lost, what, two? No, lose anybody. Okay. New famous hero? Arun's Brave Deeds. Oh, okay. He's been around for a while, faring units back and forth. Actually, let's go over and check him out. He might be worthwhile picking up, giving him some skills now. He has the falchion and the sticks and stones. 85 in leadership. What does he have? Magic resistance. It's always good. 10. Normally not very high, I guess. 8. Okay. And then his two experience here. He is at 22. No, 78. When he gets to 100, I think, he gets level 3. So now it's looking better, I think, here. We have taken back these areas. See for how long. There's some units here. The Gandavas are here in White Spring Grove. I'm counting on this river holding them back, to be honest. Um, they might be attacking from Shambalak down into Fukan. And we're not going to make it. We're not going to make... This is not going to be enough for that. 
And I can't get around it, right? Because I have to get through White Forest. He put a fortification in Pepper Plain. The temple as well. Now, we are here, though, in Lissus Lands. We're going to go ahead and, and uh, claim that throne right away. So we get five more. We can now get a... Yaksha, I think I'll take it. We'll take one of those. Yeah, we could also get some Kandava, six of them, for 18 Astral Pearls, which would be helpful to give to the Yaksha if we wanted to. We could say at least two turns, they can cast spells, they can wait and then rush forward. Just five bodyguards and the Yaksha. You may want to do that, actually. Now to get them, we need, do we need level one? No, we need level two, right? Yeah, level two. So that would be maybe you. There. And that means they're gonna be in decent shape. We have a few more units here. Now these are so good. There was a lot of body ethereal here that cast. It felt like it was a ton of them. Two blessings, two body ethereal. I think two died, right? Do we need all this? It almost feels like he may not need... Do we need to do Legions of Steel? I don't think we do. We'll take that off. He can come into the fight quicker. I like the protection. It was quite a bit of a boost. Temper Flesh is good. He's more resistant. They're going to run up with a Blessing and a Body of Thrill. I think that's good. We have three guards left. We'll leave it at that, I think. He was going to uh, be able to attack one round quicker. Now, if we take all of them and move up to White Forest, I think that's the best here at this point. Then we can decide if we want to go, where we want to go for that. If they take Fukan. Now, Whispering Wastes, what do we actually have left? You know, I'm going to take these. Move them here. Take this one guy out. Darabuja. You are going to go back and be our new commander. No, you can't go all the way, but you're going to go uh, home to Bandar Log and pick up more units. Yep, yeah, we'll do that. Now, we took this one. We have 670. Wait a minute. We have enough for a temple, for instance. I'm tempted to do it here, but I can't. <clears throat> I can't put one here. Where do we have one? I can put one in Whispering Wastes. Mm. Maybe we'll hold back a little bit and see where we go, where we're at next turn. We have two of the Holy Ones there. We have one, two here as well. So we could send one down. What are they doing here anyway? Not much, right? I think I'll send one of them down. This guy's injured anyway. Go down here and get a temple. The other ones. And what do we do with them? There. Hmm. We have 30. No orders. There. Hold. Because we're casting spells here. Yeah, let's do that. Hold. Do we want to go up and take Searing Sands or actually go to Oliathum? What do they have in Oliathum? We don't know. That was the last turn. Buddha Raja. Let's see. Buddha Raja. Was he here? Did he come back home? Yes, he did. Lost an eye. I thought they got rid of their afflictions, but he still has that. He came back as a Brahmin. He was a Brahmin. Protection 1. It's the same same as before, I think. He was just got the same one back. Okay. Now, for these, though, do we take them? <clears throat> we can take Searing Sands, I think. But we can try Oliathum. We could try that. He might attack up in Fukan anyway. Yeah, let's take them. And move up here. 
defense four. I'm going to put it to ten. It's always good to have something so they can not get in there that easily. Like we, we didn't full if we kind of worked really well. Do we stay here? I think we stay here. It's winter now. We can still get across because we have this. We're doing two preaches here. So now the, nobody has uh, the dominion there. In fact, we have dominion here with a temple, but not here. Hmm. They could build a temple. If we're thinking we're going to make it here, are we going to make it here? We could build a fortification. Hmm. That's five. Is it five turns? Four months. We got to stay here for four months with one of them. Ipsita. Is that really a smart move? <clears throat> they have the units. They're loading up. And if we lose it. But are we going to lose it before Angusa with his Gandavas show up? I don't think we will. One, two, three. If we go up all the way there. I'm tempted to do it. We own the throne of Ascension already. There's a Mercury Pond here. It's worthwhile holding. And if we wait. But we want a temple then. We don't... Hmm, that's one turn. What do we say? 600 bright gold to get the Palisades here. This province doesn't give you much income. 32. And it's going to pull in from these. It's right next to Agartha. It's going to be tough to hold, right? But if you think about it, Agartha is in bad shape. This here is not Agartha. That's Marignon. They're going to attack sooner or later, right? What is this here? Oh, there. 190. 90. They're going to take this one from him. He's going to attack. Maybe not us. I'm going to give it a shot. We'll construct a palisades. Maybe it is a bad idea, but let's do it. And then we're attacking White Forest and Uliathum. And we're also claiming the throne at the Listless Lands. Don't think I have anything else here, right? We're getting a few... Uh, no units. In Bandar Log. 25 left. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We'll save the money. Yeah. But Abaja is here. Hmm, we moved one of them down, yeah. To listless lands to maybe build a temple. Well, let's not do that. Then let's go up here as well with him. No need to do that. Instead, we could send this guy up here. He can, if nothing else, preach. No, he can't preach, but let's move him up there. And we have a little bit of research going, but not much. 49. Oof, three turns to do that. 17 fire gems, which is what I'm going to use to gain more gold, hopefully. Do we need to defend this much? No, I don't think so. We're going to instead take these, at least this turn. We will do... What is it? Research? Um, Actually, I can see it by pressing space. Uh, that's R. Yeah, okay, R. So now, 89 is better. Two turns before we get it. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. We'll see if they attack here, though. We have nobody here, but I yeah, I got my commander. Wait. The commander's moving down now. We have a few units here. I need to have a mage. Well, the Yaksha, we're getting him now. He could take those units and move down here. What do we have? Wait, we do have units in Duo Woods. We'll keep them here. Hold and attack closest. This mm, is this good to do because we're defending here. There's nothing here. We can go and get a few more. Yeah, I don't know if you're gonna make that if we defend here. <clears throat> what are we actually? What are we doing here? Um, body of therapy. We might, depending on what he brings in. 110. Hmm. Well, we'll leave it at that, though. Let's do that. Yeah, let's call it good. And I'll come back next time we'll play more. I guess.